Okay, so I'm going to speak very briefly. Um, I am very pleased to see everybody here. And really my job, I think, tonight is really basically to say thank you. You know, um, a friend of mine asked me not too long ago, uh, what was it like to have been at an organization at the beginning? And for those of you who maybe not have a chance, there is a photograph of myself and the other, I think, eight or nine people who were part of our original AIDS Health Project staff on the uh, timeline uh, in 1984. Um, I'll give you a little spoiler alert. Um, I don't look exactly like I look, <laughs> but you might want to you might want to take a look at that. No. It's just, no. <laughs> um, but uh, you know, basically, I want to say thank you. You know, and my as I was saying, a friend of mine asked me. Um, you know, what was it like to be a part of an organization that has gone from those early days to today? And obviously there's, there, there are similarities, uh, but there are also very distinct differences. And the answer to the question really was uh, gratitude. That is to say that, that uh, as Hillary Clinton has made famous, you know, the comment about it takes a village, well, that is certainly true not only of raising a child, but also raising an organization. And there have been a lot of people who have been extremely involved and extremely important to making AHP what it is today, one of whom I'm looking at right here, our very own Lori Timmis, the director of AHP. And I could just kind of go around the room, actually. There are, there are just so many people. It, it obviously does. It takes, it takes an awful lot of uh, doing. I also want to just say gratitude. George mentioned some of this, but certainly gratitude to the faculty and staff who see all of our clients day in and day out. Gratitude towards our volunteers. You know, AHP has a huge volume of volunteers, without whom we certainly could not do all of the things that we do, and so we're very grateful for them. Uh, gratitude towards our funders. Thank you, Scott Wiener. <laughs> and yes, I was, we all were waiting for that, the, the issue about the support on the budget. I have to <laughs> uh, And as well as our community advisory board, the people who help us all throughout these, these last 30 years. Um, and finally, and this has been mentioned a couple of times. I think you, you definitely get the uh, spirit of AHP through the, through the, the speakers who came before. Um, and really and truly, you know, AHP is clearly an example of, an, of a mission-driven organization. And not only is our mission uh, obviously about HIV, but clearly now as well about LGBT. And so as we celebrate and have a cake, piece of cake, for our 30th year, we also want to, I, I very much want to say that that same issue of mission-driven uh, mission work is something that we're going to carry forward hopefully for the next 30 years as we work to improve the lives and the well-being of LGBT folks. So thank you very much for being here. Um, I think Lori and I are going to cut the cake. That's <laughs> Thank you.